welcome back to my channel if you're new here don't forget to subscribe but yes today we're going over this sheen wig it's 30 inches and uh, i think 13 by 6 i'm gonna put this detail somewhere in this video like you know as a screenshot so this how the lace was looking and i was just like look at all these knots so i had to bleach it but bro i really messed up because i made the bleach too watery and it seeped through so if you see like you know if it feels weird my apologies i am not a professional <laughs> please so in this part i'm just working on my ball cap so yes i used the even lace wonder lace glue to put down my bald cap um don't forget to cut the holes for your ears okay and then i blow dry it as soon as i spray it on so it can stay in place all right And I try to do like two layers of the little spray and then, you know, I wait till it's completely dry. I'm talking about like maybe 20 minutes since I don't have like a hooded dryer. So yeah, I just wait 20 minutes so it's dry. And I definitely make sure to find a foundation that matches my skin tone and I just use a foundation brush to brush it all over my head so you know you can get that bald cap. And y'all I really do hate combs so yes I just cut them things out like I don't even be playing with that like because them things you put on my hair and I don't like that. Yeah, when I'm cutting off the lace, I just use like a scissors to make it like little jagged, ugly cuts so it's not too um straight. And then I lay it down with this elastic band. I'm telling you about this elastic band, bro. I don't know what I would do because <laughs> the lace look a little bit crazy, honey. <laughs> so funny story. This is actually the first time I installed this wig. Um I was in such a rush, so I literally just did whatever on my forehead, baby hair wise, and like ran out the door because my cousin kept blowing up my phone. Yeah, I had somewhere to go, so. To be frank, I kind of didn't even like the first and stuff like that, so I did the whole thing over again. So you see me do the baby hairs all over again, okay? Because, yeah, and I want to try dramatic baby hairs. If you are not a fan of baby hairs, my apologies, but I really want to try it out, so. So the product I'm using to slick back my hair is the Nairobi Mousse. I got from the beauty store, it's like 12 bucks. And I got the got to be gel just to put like in between where my baby hair starts and then like where the roots of the hair starts as well. So just to lay that portion down. And another reason I decided to do this portion on another day is because I had makeup on, like I said, I was rushing. And I feel like with dramatic baby hair, you gonna mess up your makeup. I'm sorry. I mean, at least depending how dramatic you want to do it. Yeah, I just used some eco style gel just to move the baby hairs around and then to clean it up a little bit. I used some scissors, cut some pieces that were too long, too not going my way, you know. Now that I'm looking back at these clips, I see that the lace looking a little bit lacy up my own front. But I think it ended up good, you know. I, this is a sheer wig, you know. This is not like, I don't know. I don't think it was HD lace, like, you know. So, I thought the ending, once I laid it and put my finish on it, it wasn't bad. Or, 
also re bleached the knots because I didn't like how bleached it was last time. You know what? I just messed up this way. I'm sorry. But <laughs> like I said, I am not professional. This is just my honest review of the wig. Okay. Okay, so boom. So to get the lace to blend a little bit more, I just put a little foundation and concealer on the lace part. And I try not to get the baby hair because I feel like that makes baby hair is like brown and I don't like that. Elastic bands always come through, okay? If your lace looking lacy, just put that elastic band on and it will melt into your skin, to be honest. Anyways, like I said, this is a dramatic baby hair tutorial. I don't want to hear nothing about no, oh my God, you did too much. I tried it for the first time. Well, yeah, one of my first times, yeah. So <clears throat> if you ever, you know, get bleach on some parts of your hair that you didn't want bleach on, you can buy this little comb root covers from the Beast Plus store. And this is just some a bottle I got from Lotta Body. It's basically water. I don't know what it is, but I just put it in the hair because I didn't have any conditioner in my house right now. And then I um, put some Nairobi mousse to um, hold the watery look. I would say that the quality of the hair itself is good. Um, it's soft to the touch, minimal shedding. I even washed it twice and I bleached it twice because I'm crazy. And it was stood all of that. Okay, so <laughs> yeah, the hair is, you know, it's not bad. So here's the final product. Got like a doll, a puppet. That's what they call it, dolls in Korea. Yeah. I look great. I feel great. <laughs> yes, this is the 30 inch sheer wig. Big head friendly. I have a huge head, so that's a good thing, you know? And this is how I did the edges. You know, they look kind of crazy. Don't judge me, I am not an artist. Or anything you know I was doing a little something the hair this is my reinstall of it because my first time I installed it I didn't really install it right I was rushing so it's my second style of it and I washed it and everything and little to no shedding it's on okay pure we'll see how long it stays on though and then black hair just hit every time go from the back to show you how long it is I'm a very tall girl, so 30 inches might be shorter than me than, you know, usual for people. You know how they be giving you like 30 inches and the clothes are like 18? Mm. That's the only thing I would say about that. But other than that, like this hair is just so, I see, I would say it's pretty full. It's giving. It's giving material, girl. <laughs> but yeah, you guys. I hope you guys like the video. I do have another sheer wig. This one is a body wig, I think, or straight, that I'm going to review as well. So be on the lookout for that. Give me any like video ideas you like to see, especially like wig wise, like what wig, what brand wigs you want me to try. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you like the content of this video. Merry Christmas. I don't know if this is gonna be posted before after Christmas, but happy holidays, happy new year, Merry Christmas, all of that. See you on the next video. Happy